What happened to the NFL quarterback? Because, man, I, I remember in the early 2000s, we used to see people, th like, if you didn't throw for 300 yards, like, you had a bad game. You know, we used to see Breeze and Brady and, hate to say it, even like Matt Ryan, three, 400 yards games. You know what I mean? Like, that was just the norm back in the day. And now you got you got stat lines like this. The quarterbacks right now with the highest yards. So I'm just going to go through some of these games. Daniel Jones threw for 281 yards and one interception. He lost. Derek Carr threw for 239 yards and interception. He lost. Matthew Stafford threw for more yards than, his, than Caleb Williams, 224 yards and interception. He lost. Jordan Love threw for 389 yards and four touchdowns and still lost. Justin Fields threw for 312 yards and one touchdown and lost. Aaron Rodgers. And this was a ridiculous game right here. So Bo Nix threw his first NFL touchdown, but he threw for 60 yards. And the Broncos beat the Jets 10 to 9. But he threw for 60 yards. I don't, I don't, I, I don't, I don't know what we're doing anymore. Um, 